One Sunday morning, like most weekends, I spent it all on the computer. It was so amusing. There was just so much to do, so much to create, so much to share. It must have sounded dumb when it was new, but now, almost everyone spends their days sitting in front of a computer screen. I was hanging out on a chat, not really saying much, but getting into the topics people were talking about. One man, under the nickname The Roker, anonymously gave me a phone number. I didn't want to be rude and prank call him, but at the same time I kept thinking, Who is this guy? He had sent me another message. Do you have an email? I replied yes, but I'm not giving you it. Then the man said fine, I'll just get it myself. It took me a while to understand that this man was trying to threaten me. This didn't scare me at all and I decided to take action by calling the number. I called and repeated, Hello? Hello? But there was no answer. No, I didn't hear deep breathing, I just heard nothing. The call dropped a few seconds afterward and decided to do more browsing, ignoring the threat. Next Sunday, I once again spent it all on the computer. When I went on, I heard an extremely loud noise that made me jump. I went on the browser, but once again, the same loud noise came out of the speakers. I checked my email and it said that I have over 666 plus messages. The last time I checked my email, which was yesterday, I only had about 34. How could I possibly get all these messages in one day? They were all under different email addresses such as nicole at ymail.com, sucker32 at gmail.com, etc. But there was one name that left me a bit curious. I'm gonna murder you 456 at live.com. Oh god, I thought to myself, did he actually find my email? I expected hate mail, but when I opened one it took me to a totally different website. It was probably the most disturbing thing ever and I tried to close the tab immediately, but it kept saying, Error, you should have told me. So I had ran into a virus. My computer wouldn't turn off either, probably part of the joke virus. There was tons of disgusting things such as extreme gore, someone being beaten with a bag that had a hammer in it, children being decapitated, tons more. He was also playing really, really really loud music. Every few seconds a screamer would pop up with different screams every time, but I noticed there was a chat on the right corner of the webpage. Only one person was online, and it was the Roker. He sent me the same phone number and said, Do you have an email?